guys yeah. have had in trying to build that? I think we're in a really good spot. You know, we got a lot of guys that can play multiple positions. You know, we're just building depth, you know, rotating guys in at different spots and just getting a lot of guys reps that haven't gotten reps in the past and seeing what they got against our really good defense. And for, you, for, for you taking on a more full-time role as center, obviously you did that some last year. But, but what, what's that like for you? How comfortable are you in that, in that pretty important yeah, I'm really comfortable in it. Like like you said, I got some uh, got a lot of reps last year at it, you know. So it's just moving in, taking on a bigger leadership role too. That's the thing, because the center and the quarterback got to be on the same page, and you know, just helping get everyone on the same page. The offensive line is huge, but I really like it. Uh, a lot of the guys that have switched from defensive line to offensive line have been pretty versatile. They've played offensive line in the past uh, yeah. more so. Has it been? E have you seen that it's been easier uh, the transition as far as chemistry wise? Yeah, Breon and Austin fit right in. I mean, they're doing a great job picking up the playbook pretty quickly. I mean, they've both adjusted really well. Like Austin transitioned in the spring and like that, he was doing really well. Breon just the other day and you know he, he's really adjusting well. And I really like seeing Breon next to me and not across from me. I would refer Jack Litch Law Group to anyone that I know because of their professional touch and they get the job done. They get it done timely and they do it right. As you just saw, our clients have trusted us. We need to reward that trust and we have with great results and great service. So call the big dogs right now, don't wait. Find us online at bigdogssmallfirm.com. about on the left hand side, I mean obviously you got Sean Christie who's an you know, experienced guy been a long time, but you got, you know, Gaddy or excuse me, um, Duncan next to him. I mean, so you got a really experienced guy, a really inexperienced guy. How's that kind of worked on that left side? Yeah, I mean Having Sean next to Jalen, I think, is great because Sean could just really help him out. You know, just learning defense. And Sean's played a lot of football, and Jalen really hasn't yet. So, just helping Jalen transition into a much larger role than he was last year. Sean's doing a great job. And then on that right side, you got the Demath guys. It yeah, looks like they've been a little <laughs> nicked up so far. But you know, what are you seeing from those guys? Yeah, I mean, you can tell they played in high school together. Those guys have great chemistry. Uh, they get along really well. They just they don't even have to say stuff, and they know exactly what uh, each other are gonna do. What's, um, the most, what's the most important thing for you when, when you're adding new quarterbacks into the fold as, as the center? Does, do you adjust it all to their preferences or is it you just me, completely the same? My number one job is to get the ball back there so we can catch it. You know, it really doesn't matter who the quarterback is. You know, I just, we just want to play ball, but we want to have a guy who's going to give us a great chance to win. Um, what are you looking for going into this week's scrimmage uh, coming out of last week? Yeah, I mean, we got to do a lot better up front protecting the quarterback. Defense had a really good day. Um, just a lot more effort across the board. You know, one of the words we use is strain. So, you know, wait right when you think you have him blocked, you're doing that little bit extra and maybe put him on the ground or get that extra two or three yards of space makes a huge difference with how good our backs are.